Well, hi. Well, hi. I'm Pam. And I'm Demi. And we're two librarians. I forgot to say it. Oh, and the library is opened. opened. Okay, today, y'all, we have a special topic that we would like to cover at the beginning. Um, a, a, a sad thing has happened. One of our biggest fans, Amy, um, who we were part of Amy's Army, and if y'all remember, participated last year in a walk. Right, we um, went walking. We went walking. Outside. Yes, because we're members of Amy's Army. Army. And she has long been a supporter of us, and we love her. And Amy has sadly um, left this earth um, and lost her battle with pancreatic cancer uh, about a week and a half ago. And so today, we would like to dedicate this episode to Amy and her family and her little boy Maddox and Tina and the bandages and uh, everybody who loved her. And her army. And her army. And this book, go ahead, you can grab it, Danny. It's called I Am Love. A Book of Compassion. And we love this book because we think that Amy was just filled with love. That's right. And it's by Susan Green and art by Peter H. Reynolds. Well, it's Susan Verde. Oh, that's right. Which also means green. Which also means But her green. name is Susan Verde. Verde. Ver Verde. What if it's just Verde? And it's Abrams Prius. Abrams Prius. Okay. Right? Right. I think. Yeah, Abrams Books, Books for, young for Young Readers. readers. Alright. Is that part of it? No, that's not part of it. Alright. Okay. Oh, I'm going to adjust so I can try to read to y'all. Alright. Oh, sorry. It's okay. When I see someone going through a storm, of hurt and unfairness, of danger and sadness. Or anger and sadness. Oh, oh, of anger, right. When the sun disappears and the skies grow dark. And I see there is fear. I ask myself, what can I do to help let the light back in? I put my hands on my heart and listen, and that is where I find the answer. I have compassion. I act with tenderness. I am love. I can listen and not say a word. I can be there. Love is being present. I can hug and hold and say, everything will be all right. Love is comfort. I can speak softly and choose my words and actions carefully. Love is gentle. I can give thanks for all I have and I am able to share. Love is gratitude. I can keep my mind and body safe and healthy. Love is taking care of me. I can express what's important to me. Love is creative. I can know that no one is perfect. Love is understanding. I can do my best to make things better when something is wrong. Love is effort. I can celebrate those I've loved before. Love is remembering. Love is remembering. That's right. I can find goodness in a kind word, a helping hand, or a shared smile. Love is tiny gestures. I can breathe in the air that the whole world shares and know all creatures 
are made from the very same stardust. Love is connection. When the clouds roll in for others and for me, I know there is something I can do. I can let my heart lead the way. I am love. You are love. We are love. And with love, we will weather the storm and light up the sky. Together. Yeah. That was wonderful. That was and what a wonderful way to honor Amy's legacy. It sure was. And it, it reminded me because no matter what storm was handed to Amy, Amy always led with love. We'd like to thank y'all for tuning in today. And we'd like to remind you to hashtag, no matter what the cause, save with stories. You can also prescribe to our channel at Pam and Demi on the tube view. And to remember, the more you view, the more we'll be for you. I'm Pam. I'm Demi. And we're two, two librarians. librarians. I remember. I don't know. I gotta go.